Hey everyone, you are on the Proxy Seller channel. My name is Max. In today's video, we will provide a detailed overview of the Multi-Login Anti-Detect browser and explore its key features. Let's get started. Multi-Login is an anti-detection browser tailored for multi-accounting, web automation, and the development of applications and websites. It facilitates the configuration of proxy servers and digital fingerprints, enabling users to manage thousands of accounts seamlessly without the risk of being blocked. Additionally, Multi-Login is well-suited for collaborative efforts, offering built-in features that allow multiple team members to work efficiently within the same environment. Let's explore the tariff plans offered by Multi-Login. There are four different plans available. Regardless of the plan chosen, users will have access to several essential functions. The capability to configure proxy servers, creation of unlimited one-time profiles, settings for digital fingerprints, and the synchronization of profiles across different devices. Here's an overview of the tariff plans available. The Starter Plan, priced at €29 Euros per month. This plan is tailored for individual users. It permits the creation of up to 10 browser profiles, with storage options available for both in the cloud and locally. This plan does not support the addition of team users and does not provide an automation token, limiting the automation capabilities for routine processes. It includes one gigabyte of proxy traffic for anonymous profile operations. The Solo Plan, costing €79 Euros per month with a 20% discount. This plan is also designed for individual use. It allows for the creation of up to 100 browser profiles with no option to add team users. Profile storage is available both in the cloud and locally. The plan offers API access at a rate of 50 requests per minute or RPM and includes 5 gigabytes of proxy traffic to ensure stable and anonymous operations. The team plan, at a price of 159 euros per month with a 20% discount, this plan is intended for team use. It supports the creation of 300 browser profiles and allows for the addition of an unlimited number of team users. Storage for profiles is provided both in the cloud and locally. The plan offers enhanced API access at 100 RPM and includes 10 gigabytes of proxy traffic for secure and anonymous team operations. The Custom Plan. The pricing for this plan is determined based on the specific needs of users and teams. It offers personalized access to browser features, including customizable limits on profiles and team members. This plan provides unlimited API access and allocates a higher volume of proxy traffic to accommodate extensive and uninterrupted anonymous operations. Let's examine the main features of Multi-Login next. Multi-Login allows detailed adjustments of digital fingerprints for each browser profile ensuring a high level of privacy when managing accounts. Key parameters include user agent, information about the user's browser and device, screen resolution, fonts, time zone, and system languages, geolocation, user device processor model, WebRTC, and other settings. Many of these parameters can be manually configured, while some are automatically adjusted to match the IP address used enhancing consistency in the digital footprint when using proxies and reducing detection risks. The API functionality of Multi-Login offers several advantages for web automation and data management. It enables programmatic management of digital data, seamlessly adapting to a variety of tasks. The API supports the simultaneous management of a large number of unique browser profiles. Combined with Multi-Login's features, the API contributes to the automation of routine tasks, such as data collection, account registration, and content verification. The integration of Puppeteer and Selenium allows you to automate the processes of creating and managing accounts, as well as the development of scripts and web crawlers for substitution of digital fingerprints and collecting specific data. Selenium integrates via remote web driver to connect to browser profiles through a local port, this setup allows for configuring and executing commands within a specific profile, useful for automating complex tasks. Puppeteer, a Node.js tool that automates actions via the Chrome DevTools protocol. It is ideal for creating web crawlers that operate with the Mimic browser, using unique fingerprints to gather data 
without risking account tracking. Another distinctive feature of multi-login is the ability to create one-time profiles, which are automatically deleted after closing. This feature is particularly useful for tasks requiring quick setups, such as configuring proxies to bypass regional restrictions. Users can select the operating system, browser, and proxy server settings for these profiles, optimizing them for specific short-term tasks. Now let's take a closer look at each element of the interface. The All Profiles tab allows you to create, edit, and distribute profiles across groups. A handy switch enables sorting between cloud and local profiles. Cloud profiles are accessible on any device logged into your account, while local profiles are limited to the device you're currently using. When setting up a new profile, you can modify its digital fingerprint, name it, and categorize it into a group for easy tracking. The tab also includes mobile profiles that mimic the behavior of mobile browsers, complete with features like orientation, zooming, and touch gestures, simplifying the process of testing websites on mobile devices. In the Team Members tab, you can manage your team effectively, here you can send invitations to potential team members and assign specific access levels to various profile folders. Once members are added, the primary interactions such as managing profiles occur from the start page designated for profiles. Additionally, this tab allows for the removal of team members or adjustment to their access rights as needed. The My Account tab allows you to adjust the global settings for both your profiles and the application. In this section, you can change your password and unsubscribe from services. Additionally, it provides access to logs, which are useful for monitoring user activity and identifying and troubleshooting browser errors. The default profile settings feature enables you to configure a range of parameters that will be applied automatically when creating new profiles. These settings include the default browser to be used for new profiles, the preferred language for different browser versions, the screen resolution, options to enable the saving of passwords, bookmarks, and browsing history. Additionally, the Application Settings section allows you to choose the application's language, optimize it for website interaction, and activate widgets for support and messages, enhancing the user experience and functionality. In the Plugins tab, you have the ability to manage extensions that enhance the functionality of your browser profiles. The final tab, the Support Center, serves as a resource hub where you can find answers to common questions, access detailed documentation, and reach out to the support services if you encounter any issues with the browser. Creating a new profile in multi-login involves a few straightforward steps. Begin by clicking the Create New button located on the left side of the browser interface. A window will appear where you need to enter the name of the profile. Here you can also add it to a previously created group. Select the operating system and choose the browser you wish to use. It's generally best to keep the default settings for the time zone, WebRTC, and geolocation since these will automatically be aligned with the IP address. Additionally, click Get New Fingerprint to generate a digital fingerprint. Proceed to the Advanced Settings in the Navigator section. You have the option to modify the user agent, screen resolution, and browser language, and activate the Do Not Track feature. You can also adjust the fonts and hardware features like Canvas and WebGL, though these are usually masked by default to preserve anonymity, so frequent changes are not typically necessary. Once all the necessary information is entered, click Create Profile at the bottom of the window. After the profile is successfully created, navigate to the All Profiles tab and click Start to run the profile. For more options, click the three dots on the right of the profile entry where you can edit the profile, move it to a different group, or import cookies if needed. To set up proxy settings in multi-login, follow these steps. Start multi-login and click on the Create New button from the main menu. Navigate to Proxy and then select Edit Proxy Settings, located under the Proxy Settings section. From the drop-down list, choose HTTP Proxy. Input the necessary details. For the IP, use the format IP address, colon, and port. The username and password details can typically be found in your order confirmation email or directly in the control panel of your proxy provider. Click Check Proxy to verify the settings. 
If you see a green check mark, the proxy configuration is correct and you can proceed with the rest of the setup. Multi-login is a robust and adaptable tool, renowned for its extensive features in proxy services, web automation, and digital fingerprint customization. Its emphasis on data privacy and commitment to regular updates position it as an ideal solution for users with stringent demands for automation and security. The platform facilitates the creation of both mobile and one-time profiles, and its flexible pricing policy makes it accessible for a range of users. Multi-login provides secure account management capabilities, making it suitable for handling tasks of any scale with precision and reliability. Remember, free proxies pose security risks and lack reliable anonymity, often leading to blocks. For secure and private online experiences, turn to our company, Proxy Seller. We offer 100% anonymity and top-notch security. Our selection caters to various needs, supported by 24-7 assistance. Check the description for a 10% discount code and a link to our site. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notifications by clicking on the bell and hit the like button. That's all for now. I'll see you guys in the next video.